Viewers still have many questions about the vaccines and recent guideline changes. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is back to answer more of your questions submitted through clickondetroit.com, starting with a concern about being vaccinated. Doc? Yeah, Kim. So a viewer is wondering, should you get the COVID vaccination if you don't have a spleen? Is that safe for you? The COVID vaccines are recommended for people without a spleen. There is no safety concern. What we don't know, though, is whether they have the same level of effectiveness if you don't have a spleen. Now, here are some more of your questions. Amelia asks, I read that the J&J &J vaccine is less effective against the new Delta variant. I got the J&J &J vaccine on March 15th. Would you suggest looking at getting a Pfizer dose for added protection? Amelia, based on some recently published data, the Pfizer vaccine has about a 33% efficacy after one dose and 83% efficacy after the second dose against the Delta variant. Now, so far, there hasn't been a study specifically looking at the J&J &J vaccine against the Delta variant, but we expect it would be somewhere around 60% effective. While there is information suggesting that a dose of a different vaccine might enhance protection, it's too early to generalize that into a broad recommendation. If you are at high risk because of age or an immune-compromised condition, you should talk with your doctor. Now, another viewer is wondering, should children wear masks if outside together? Example, swim club, camps, etc. I would say masks are not necessary in that situation outside. Right now, the overall risk of COVID transmission is low, especially outdoors. Sheila asks, of the most recent deaths, are any of them fully vaccinated or are they all unvaccinated? The last time the state gave data on breakthrough cases, there were 189 deaths in vaccinated people, with 171 of them in people 65 or older. To put that in context, that was out of more than 4.4 million fully vaccinated people at the same point in time. So 0.004% of fully vaccinated people died of COVID. Now, finally, a viewer wants to know if I have MS, multiple sclerosis, should I get the vaccine shots? The answer is yes. There is every reason to believe the vaccine would be of benefit and there is no known risk surrounding MS. Back to you. Very, very important and good questions to ask as always. We appreciate it, Dr. McGeorge.